Hi everyone, this is Christian Knife Guy here. Special knife year for you. Well, it's not too special. Um, kind of special to me. I like it. <laughs> it's a little dark red bone. Um, I believe this is like the pocket worn editions that they did. Uh, peanut. And it is from, I believe it's a 90. Hey, but I could be wrong. Let's see if we can make the tank stamp out. Let's see what it is. My camera never wants to focus when it's supposed to. 98. That's a 97, that's a three dot. Let me look at this closer off camera. Oh, it's a two dot and the camera just blurries it. It's actually a two dot there. So it's a 98. Um, <clears throat> as far as a, four, a small knife, this is really probably the smallest you can get that's going to have a decent quality, like a really good quality. If they start getting smaller than this, the quality of them, or I want to say, not the quality, it's still good quality. Sorry, don't hold me that. The fit and finish of the knife tends to not be as grand as <clears throat> some of your other knives. This one right here, the peanut, is just still small, but yet big enough for the craftsmanship and fit and finish to be superb. Um, I've seen Eisenhower's and pen knives where the craftsman, and even the, some small Texas toothpicks I've seen where the fit and finish is just not really that great as far as case, as case knife quality should have caught. Um, as far as I'm concerned on that, um, here you got your um, stainless steel springs, brass uh, liners, nickel bolsters, wood, dyed red wood. This is a, uh, a deep red jig bone. Um, there's no cracks in it at all. Brass pins, they're not protruding, so they're all flesh. You don't see them raised. Smooth. You don't feel any rough spots back here. No gaps. No gaps whatsoever. <clears throat> um, you don't get very much of a snap. Here's your main blade. It's got a little bit of usage on it. Let's see a little bit of up in there. No half stop. A little bit of snap right there. You got a half stop on the small blade. And a lot of time you get grime down in there. Don't look like there's any down in there. A lot of times you'll get some grime down in here and that'll cause it to uh, that rust. Got a little bit of rust spot starting right there. Yep, there's a little bit of discoloration right there on that blade. To hit that with some case paste. This has been a user. It's it's a pretty nice little decent knife. You can pick these up. They're not that expensive unless you start getting like your stag. More exotic material. Mammoth tooth. So you have a 1998 case peanut red jig bone. This is the pocket worn edition. 
So till next time, friends. Remember, don't cut yourselves.